Assalamu alaikum I hope you guys doing okay now video mujhe kaafi der pehle bana dena chahiye thi but like everything else we can blame it on corona aaj ki video mein hum baat karenge ki when and what kind of camera should you get for photography so let's get started कि आपके दोस्त के पास एक आखिर किस्म का कैमरा है एनी गोइंग थ्रू हिस्स पिक्चर्स यू लाइक वो दो सर एक्चुअली गुड एंड यू डिसाइड दैट यू वांट टू गेट इनटू फोटोग्राफी बट यू आर नॉट श्योर व्हिच एंड व्हाट काइंड ऑफ कैमरा शुड यू गेट बिकॉज़ ट्रस्ट मी इट्स नॉट इजी सो आई विल गाइड यू व्हेन एंड व्हाट काइंड ऑफ कैमरा शुड यू गेट फोटोग्राफी नाउ इफ यू आर समवन हु डजंट हैव एनी नॉलेज अबाउट द कैमरा एंड द ओनली पिक्चर्स यू टेक्स आर सेल्फी इट्स बेटर यू स्टार्ट विद अ कैमरा व्हिच यू ऑलरेडी हैव and in this case it will be your smartphone now i know you are wondering that why smartphone and why not a proper camera the reason is that once you get into photography there's a lot of expenses you have to buy a camera you have to buy a lens tripod and the list goes on and on and on now, rather than spending all that money on the phone it is better if you get some knowledge about the photography using your iphone or android or whichever one you choose the biggest advantage is that it's always with you no matter where you go and all you have to do is just take it out of your pocket start shooting now this will give you an idea how to take pictures and rules of photography and you can even edit them on your mobile phone using snapseed or mobile lightro now let's say that you have basic knowledge about photography and you want to get more out of your pictures it's time to get a basic dslr or mirrorless camera now here i would advise to get a basic camera but a good lens because the chances are you're going to stick with your lens longer than the body for example i got this 50mm back in 2003 And since then I have changed three camera bodies but still sticking out to this one. Now let's say that you want to take photography to the next level and your current camera is not able to cope with the things you want to do. In that case move to the full front body. Now these are really expensive cameras and you want to make sure that you're earning some money out of it to get these ones. And if you're not I would suggest to stick with your crop frame sensors. So that it is guys I hope you like the video give me a thumbs up and even subscribe to my YouTube channel and even comment what you want to see next in the videos so till then take care